Hello, welcome back to the videos on indexes. So here is another issues. So let's say uh, we are going to do uh, we have a table say table uh, T. So table T has uh, you know three columns A, B, and C. And then you know I have uh, this you know some value one, five, seven, and then just like you know let's say I have total one million rows. One. So let's say I have I have one million rows on this table okay and now somebody is saying uh, like can you uh, do a query that query is going to do select star from table t where a plus b into c is greater than 5 okay so if i have to do this thing like you know if somebody asked me to write to to run this query then what oracle is going to do is going to basically do a compute on this thing a plus b 1 plus 5 5 multiplied by 7 is 35 is greater than 5 yeah is 5 then okay it is going to fetch this row and then it's going to do all the way this computation and then scan all this table and then you know with 1 million rows in the table this query is going to take a long time so therefore we are going to do index so on which what do i index so if i do index on a right if i do an index on a then is it going to solve my problem no because my condition here is not a greater than 5 my condition here is this a plus b into c this the combination of this value you know whatever this whatever this computed value of this thing is greater than 5 okay so therefore by simply creating a index either on a b or c will not work so what is going to work if i can pre-compute this value a plus b into c and then create an index on that and this is Basically, what you say, you can term this as a function, right? So, if I create this function and then I compute this, basically, you know, I compute this value and store this in index, then that is going to help. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create an in, in a function-based index. So, this is basically, you know, essentially, this is called, you know, this concept is called function-based index. So, here, in this function-based index, we are going to whenever we are going to do this create this index we are going to have compute this value and pre-store it so that means the index will contain a plus b into c and then what is the value of this you know it's going to compute 1 plus 5 is 6 into 742 and then whatever this row id is going to store here then next one you know whatever this value and then that row id and so on so it will store store in this table and whenever so store in this index so whenever you're going to select star from em star from t then it is going to get and search here first get the row id and then fetch that row id for 157 so this is called in you know, a very simple concept called function best index so so far uh, we have probably uh, discussed four different types of uh, indexes so one is your b tree second thing is reverse key third thing is bitmap fourth thing is function best index there is what we're going to do now uh, instead of explaining the remaining three uh, you know different types of implementation so let's dive into some some examples and then try to see like you know what is you know what kind of some kind of scenario and then try to define our index strategies